This guy right here is slicing some tortillas and we prepare some tostadas, fresh tostadas, we put them on the on the grill and then uh, we use them like square. But this this isn't a waste. This this we fry them and then we put them with some sweet potato. We deep fry them and we use them as a crunchy garnish on the, whatever the plate that we decide to make that day. This is what we do. This who in, who invented that? Yeah. Uh, actually, I came up with that idea because uh, we were wasting the, the edges of the tortilla and then we were wasting the the, what, the edges of the sweet potato. So I was like, why why would we waste it? I mean, I don't even like wasting the seeds of the jalapenos or anything. I save them because we have a, a, a crops. We have like a farm in, in Rosarito. So every seed that I can save, I put them in the back, bring them to the guys over there. They plant it and they bring the product right here. This yeah. is how. You waste nothing. 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 So, so we smoke this almond in, well, in our kitchen. It has uh, this black this black thing. It's called uh, chilmole, which is a Mayan recipe. It's made out of uh, burned seeds, garlic, condiments, and then that paste, because it's, it's, uh, it's, paste, it's a pasty thing, it, uh, we make it more liquidy with uh, orange juice. Can you tell me a little about the octopus dish? Well, we have two kinds of uh, ways of preparing the octopus. The one we call it kraken, which is a blend of Mexican herbs. And uh, the other one we call it chicana, which is a uh, pulpo a la gallega. Octopus at the gallega, which is a Spanish dish. We just add some uh, Mayan recipes, Mayan ingredients, and uh, we call it like that because, you know, chicanas are like a blend of Mexican with something else. Yeah. So that's why we call it that. It has also some uh, some raw cactus on that. The octopus with raw cactus makes that a nice combination. Adicionarle el puro en pasta, que sería el amarillo, pero este no es cierto, el que ya viene preparado, que se lo adicionamos directamente a la preparación. Y si la diferencia. Le coloco arriba unos tomatitos cherry y una hojita de albahaca.